Hey guys, what is up? And thank you so much for tuning into another video. I know it's been a minute, so thank you so much for coming back. So um, today I'm gonna be doing a dumber, double Hermes unboxing with you guys. And I actually have the two items right here. Um, these items were not very intentional. Um, but they are timeless. Um, I actually went to our mall in Orlando and I had an appointment with Prada. So when I got there, Prada was a bit busy and were not able to take me right away. So Hermes was two doors down. So I was like, okay, let me pop on over to Hermes and see what's up with them. So this is what's up. Okay, here we are today. Um, so that's why I say that they weren't intentional <laughs> purchases, but um, yeah, I'm definitely gonna get a lot of use out of them though. So um, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the unboxing. I actually um, have been wanting to open these items for the past couple days, but um, I was trying to wait to do a proper unboxing. So here we are. Um, I think I'm gonna flip you guys around for this portion. Should I, or should I do it front facing? Okay, so here is the first item. They packaged it up so nicely. So let's just go ahead and take the ribbon off. And it comes with two dust bags, so that should give you a clue as to what the item is. And it's a pair of the Hermes Oran sandals. Um, I already have these um, in the color orange, you know, the same color as the box, but this is a neutral. Um, I think they call this one gold. Um, it's like a, not a chocolate brown, but it's a pretty nice tan brown. And I picked this up in the size 40. Oh, actually, this is a 41, sorry. So I needed a 40.5, but they have a 41. And so it'll just give me a little extra space in the toe box. So yeah, um, it just has like the white seams along the, the H here. And yeah, I just really love them. They're almost the same as my skin tone. So they really melt into my skin. And yeah, they are super nice. So take off the other one. And they're in pretty pristine condition as they should be. Um, they're brand new, obviously. So yeah, super duper nice. Love them so much. And I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out of these come this summer. Um, and I mean, I live here in Florida, so it's not too cold right now to wear these. Like I can basically wear these year round. We only have a couple, I would say a couple weeks of really cold weather and it's typically um, in the month of February or like getting closer towards the holidays and things like that, like Christmas, Thanksgiving. So yeah, these are the Oran sandals love them so much i know these are really sought after um i will say my first pair was in i think the togo leather this is more of a smooth leather so i think that these can be scratched a lot easier than the other pair that i have and honestly the other pair did not wear sorry if you hear that noise that's my dog um the other pair didn't wear too well honestly this toe box here um i guess i wore them in the sand so it has like some dark stains from where the sand kind of like distorted the color of the, you know, the insole here. So yeah, but I'm gonna give them another shot. Hopefully these will be better to me, treat me a little better. And so yeah, that is the first item. And we're gonna sit those off to the side. And let's get into this other item. And actually, let me go ahead and move these. This is the other item came in a box as well um and then it has just a card here that has my receipt and everything and i will tell you the price so iran sandals were 630 dollars and this item was a thousand twenty five dollars so the total was about 17.62 with taxes included here in florida so all right let's get into this one go ahead and take off the ribbon This one also has two dust bags. And I got 
a pair of loafers. I'm not actually sure what the name of these loafers are. I can try to link them in the description box and let you know. But these are in a size 40. I think they're 40 or 40.5. These are size 40. So um, it's so funny. My shoe size is a bit smaller in the closed toe shoes um, as compared to the open toe shoes. So I could have gone with the 39, but I'll be able to wear socks with these. Um, and so yeah, I just got a pair of loafers. I don't know why I'm so into loafers lately. Here is the other one. Um, they're in a smooth um, lambskin leather. So I will say lambskin is very delicate, especially when it comes to shoes because I have a pair of Balenciaga lambskin boots. And I ended up scraping the toe inadvertently because they are like knife boots. So they ended up you know they're pretty long in the front not knife boots but they have a longer toe so i ended up scuffing up the toe um you know when i first got them so yeah i will say you do have to be a bit more careful with them um this is just the overview though of how these look they are very nice they are timeless they have the silver silver h and again that is the bottom i really really love them so so much i feel like i'm gonna get a lot of use out of these um i'll just have to be a bit more careful but um i typically take pretty good care of my items not only my luxury items but my you know daily items that i'm using all the time i will say i'm not very happy with this creasing already since i have not worn them i only tried them on for a brief second in the rms boutique and it already has that creasing i don't know if this paper was pushed in too far nope it's just already creased so that's a bit disappointing um it looks like there's no plastic on the h either for me to remove unless it's super fine plastic but um normally they have plastic covering the hardware but um yeah guys these are the two items that i picked up the loafers <laughs> and i'm only sitting these on the table because they have not been worn of course the loafers and the oran sandals so yeah really love them love them so much Okay guys, so I'm back and um, I just want to talk to you guys a little bit about the fit of the shoe. Um, I would say that um, these shoes run a bit narrow in this region of course, um, but if you have a wider foot, I think these little holes right here will save you. I will also say if you buy the ones that are the Togo leather, go ahead and give it you have to just have faith that they're gonna loosen up because my last pair, I was just like, oh my gosh, I didn't know how I was gonna do it, but I already had worn them around the house and I just didn't know like if I was gonna have to resell them. So just give it like maybe, just wear them a couple times, they'll loosen up, they'll be your go-to shoe. So these right now, they feel pretty good. Um, I don't know if it's because they are a different type of leather um, than the other ones that I got, but these are already feeling very good. Um, probably just after wearing them out one time, they'll be perfect. Um, but I will say just for me wearing them around the house right here in this front area of my home, the bottom of them have already gotten like, I don't know if you can see that. Look at the bottom of them already. Just from like trying them on, 
in this video they've already gotten dirty so um yeah make sure you're sure before you wear them on tile because you'll be stuck with them they will not return or let you return or exchange them because they will look lived in after just trying them on on wood or tile so make sure you find like a carpeted area stay on that area while you try to break them in and see what you're gonna do because if i wasn't sure about these I will be stuck with them um, because of, yeah, how the bottom looks now. And I don't know why the camera's not picking that up. There we go. Yeah, that is insane. <laughs> so yeah, I would say they run a bit narrow, but this will save you. Also, these, I will say they run a bit narrow too, guys. I'm kind of unhappy about this, this um, creasing that has happened and I'm just like, really trying them on for the first time here at home now i'm just like very unhappy with that honestly i know it's gonna happen but i want it to happen because i did it not because i bought them that way they already look worn i don't know i might have to reach out to my essay because you can feel the creases they're very deep and you can feel them under like in here you can feel them i don't want to cause no problems because i am you know trying to get on the list or i am on the list for a birkin or um a kelly now I don't want to cause any problems, but at the same time, I need a new pair of shoes. So, yeah, we'll see. I'll let you know what I end up doing about these. Um, so yeah, overall, I'm pretty happy with my purchase other than the shoes already looking worn in for me. Um, but yeah, I feel like I'll let you know what happened. So anyway guys, thank you so much for tuning in to another video. Thank you so much for coming back. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to hit the like, comment, subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it and I will see you in the next one. Bye.